Hi guys, welcome to Pilates with Hina and this is the best cardio core Pilates workout. This will be the best heart pumping 30 minute up workout of your week. For each movement, we will do it slow first to work your abs and then speed it up to increase your heart rate. So when you're ready, just roll on your mat and let's begin. Alright, so let's start with coming to the own fall position. Now, open your arms shoulder apart, your legs hip width apart, pull your belly button in and keep your shoulder far away from your ears. Make sure that your shoulder is on top of your wrist and your hips on top of your knees. Tuck your feet here. Now I want you to inhale, pull your belly button in and lift your knee up and bring it down. Knees up and down, belly button in and use the breath to control the movement. So inhale up and exhale down. Lift and couple more times with your own breath. Make sure you always look down to the mat and lengthen your neck here. Keep breathing. Squeeze your butt, squeeze in your thighs. And six, five, four, Three, inhale and exhale down. Two, and last time. Very good. Shake your hips a little bit. Inhale deeply and exhale deeply. Get ready for the cardio thing. We will try to do as much as you can in 10 counts. So inhale deeply and exhale. Start to lift very quick. And belly button in. Keep breathing. Nine, eight. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Slowly knees down, shake your hips from left to right. And now this time, I want you to inhale and lengthen one leg and lengthen the other opposite arm here. So I want you to inhale, lift your leg up and exhale, bring it down. Couple more times with your own breath, only on the right leg and opposite arm first. So keep breathing, make sure that you keep your hips balanced and stabilized here. Don't shift your hips to one side. Very good. And keep breathing, make sure that you focus on the central, lengthen your neck and look down to the mat, so that way you don't lose balance on your whole body. Very good. And keep breathing, belly button in. And five, four, Three, two, last time. Bring it down slowly with your breath and to the other side. Now lengthen, lengthen the opposite arm to the front. Inhale and exhale, lift your leg up. Bring both arms and legs down and lift it up. Keep breathing. Inhale up and exhale down, belly button in. Try to lengthen your arm and your leg to the opposite way. Feel like someone pulling them away from the center. Very good. And keep breathing. Inhale deeply and exhale deeply. And five, four. Activate your foot. Feel, try to lengthen here and keep stabilize your hips. So last time, slowly. Bring it down, shake your hips from left to right. And this time, inhale, lengthen your opposite leg and arm. Slowly bring your leg up and try to keep balance here. Dorsi flex with your feet. Now start to make a little pulse with your arms and your legs here. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Slowly. Bring it down to the other side. Lengthen, bring your arm up and leg up. Keep balance, engage your core here. Dorsi flex with your feet and start to make a little pulse with your arm and opposite leg. So keep breathing. Five, four, three, two, and one. Slowly bring your legs down, shake the hips here. Very good. Now from here, I want you to inhale and lengthen your leg, keep your hips balanced, lengthen the other legs here, open your leg hip with the part, 
bring your hips down, come to full plank, make sure you don't arch your back like this, or around your spine, just keep it in between, lengthen your neck here, now inhale, bring one knee to elbow, and to the other side, couple more times with your own breath, and keep breathing, make sure that your shoulder is on top of your wrist here, so we do it, belly button in slowly, exhale, inhale, lengthen, exhale, and inhale, lengthen. Now I want you to exhale through your mouth, inhale through your nose, and couple more times with your own breath. Keep breathing, five, to the other side, four, to the other side, three, and keep breathing. Two more times with your own breath, and last time to your right, last time to your left, knees down, come to tripod and rotate your wrist and reverse, take a deep inhalation and exhale through your mouth here and when you're ready, I want you to come back to own four position and let's get ready for the cardio thing now, again, shoulder on top of your wrist here now, step back and the other leg back start to do it as much as you can in 10 cal and start make sure you stabilize your hips 10 9 quicker a little bit speed it up 8 7 6 belly button in squeeze your butt here and keep breathing 5 4 Last time, beautiful, bend your knees down, come to tripod, take a deep breath, inhale deeply through your nose, and exhale deeply through your mouth. Very good. Now from here, I want you to inhale and slowly come back to your position here. Now for the core thing, I want you to open your leg here with the part, tuck your feet here, inhale, and put your shoulder far away from your ears, lengthen your neck. Now still keep stabilize your neck here, lift your hips up all the way up and look towards your heels and bring it down. Inhale up, pull your belly button in and slowly with your breath. So use the breath to control the movement. Couple more times with your own breath. Ten, belly button in. Nine, keep breathing. Eight. When you shift your weight to the front, I want you to lengthen your neck and look down to the mat and shoulder on top of your wrist here. And five more times with your own breath. Four, keep breathing, engage your core. Contract your pelvic floor muscle here. And two, last time, knees down. Shake your hips from left to right, very good. Now from here, I want you to inhale, do it, speed it up to make the cardio thing. So inhale deeply and exhale. And when you're ready, lift your hips up and shift and lift and shift and quicker a little bit here with your own breath. Keep breathing, lift your heels up a little bit to make it easier. Very good. Soften your knees, pull your belly button in and keep breathing. And seven, six, five, speed it up. Belly button in, lengthen and stabilize your neck here so your shoulder is moving and your neck is just always follow it. And three, two, and last time, knees down, hips up, and bring it down. Shake your hips from left to right. Take a deep breath, inhale deeply, and exhale deeply. Very good. Now from here, I want you to inhale and slowly keep your hips and your knees together. Now this time, put your shoulder far away, lengthen your leg, and make sure that your hips are balanced and stabilized here. Now inhale deeply, lift your knees up, and exhale, bring it down. Couple more times with your own breath. Eyes on elbows facing each other. 
and we do it a couple more times with your own breath. Make sure that you pull your belly button in, keep breathing. Inhale and exhale and lift and down and lift and bring it down. Very good. Slowly and do it with control. So we do it five, four, three. Keep breathing, inhale up and exhale down and last time bring it down knee bend to the other side inhale lift and exhale down slowly with your own breath and keep breathing make sure you pull your belly button in and keep your shoulder far away from your ears so a couple more times stay with your own breath beautiful inhale lift and exhale down and lift and bring it down and five lift and down four keep breathing inhale up exhale down three two and last time bring it up and now bend your knees shake your hips here rotate your wrist if you need and reverse now from here again i want to lengthen the other leg and start to speed it up as much as you can so inhale deeply and start to lift engage your core as much as possible make sure your hips are balanced here and eight, nine, seven, six, four, three, two, and one. Bring it down to the other side here. Lengthen, inhale deeply, and exhale. Start. Keep breathing. Engage your core and make sure you don't arch your back. So keep your back neutral here. Keep breathing and speed it up as much as you can. Five, four, three, two, and one. Very good. Bring it down. Shake your hips around, left to right. Now come back to try pose, pose it, and take a deep breath. Inhale and exhale. Now this time, lengthen your leg and lift your leg up. Now from here, inhale and exhale. Knee to the side and bring it back and knee to the side up close towards your elbows and bring it back couple more times with your own breath keep breathing engage your core as much as possible and slowly make sure that your hips stabilize and balance here and lengthen your leg all the way to the back and keep breathing so three two lengthen and last time stabilize your torso here and bring it back to the other side step lengthen your leg lift it up inhale and exhale knee to elbow and lift and knee to elbow and lift couple more times with your own breath keep breathing in your core as much as possible and lengthen your leg like someone pulling your leg away from your hips keep breathing very good and five lengthen four and lengthen three more times two one and bring it down shake your hips from left to right now for the cardio thing i want you to again step back and now tuck your left foot and lift your heel knees up here inhale and when you're ready i want you to start to bring your knee toward the side like the previous one so ready and start 10 9 speed it up 8 7 6 5 4 3 2 and last time knee down and to the other side lengthen now inhale again put your shoulder far away from your ears eyes on elbows facing each other lift your knee up and slowly start ready and start 10 9 8 belly button in and keep breathing lengthen your neck 6 5 4 keep breathing 3 2 and 1 beautiful knees down shake your hips come to tripos rotate your wrist here and reverse Beautiful. All right. 
Now inhale deeply through your nose and exhale deeply through your mouth. Allow yourself to lie down on your stomach. Bring your hand neck to your chest here. Curl your elbows to the back and tuck your feet. Now lengthen your neck, bring it down. Now press your shoulder towards your hips. Inhale deeply, lift your torso up and exhale deeply, bring it down. Couple more times with your own breath. So belly button in, inhale, lift, and exhale down. And keep breathing, use the breath to control the movement. Inhale up, and exhale down. And six, five, always make sure that you put your shoulder far away from your ears and your elbows close back toward each other. Two, and last time, inhale, lift, and exhale slowly, bring it down, shake your hips. Now for the cardio thing, your head and your shoulder up. Now press your shoulder down towards your hips here, engage your core. And I want you to try to push a little bit higher, engage your core as much as possible. Hip bones stick down to the mat and bring it back and down. So we try to make a little pulse here with your own breath and feel your arms is working. Very good. And 10. Speed it up if you can. Nine, eight, in your core, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Slowly bring it up. My arms are burning. Very good. Now lengthen your leg to the back and palms facing down to the mat. Inhale deeply and exhale, bring one leg up. Bring it down to the other side. Make sure you pull your belly button in and squeeze your butt here. Couple more times with your own breath. Keep breathing. Reach your hand towards your heels. And couple more times with your own breath. Make sure that you keep your belly button in to support your lower back. You can slightly lift your head a little bit up and keep breathing. Lengthen your neck. Slowly down with control and up and down and to the other side. Very good. And five, four, three, two, and last time. Bring it down, head down, shake your hips from left to right. Very good. Now from here, for the cardio, I want you to lift your head and your shoulder off the mat. Make sure you engage your core to support your lower back if, and then bring your legs up. If you feel uncomfortable with your lower back here, always bring your head down, okay? So now we can start try to make a little pulse. Make sure that your hip bones stick down and stabilize your hip bones here. So we try to do it as much as you can in 10 cows. Lengthen your arms, press it down and when you're ready, belly button in and start squeeze your inner thighs, engage your core as much as possible and keep breathing. Eight, seven, six, five. Engage your core and try to wider the range of movement here. And five, four, three, two, and one. Bring it down. Shake your hips from left to right. Very good. Now from here, I want you to inhale and then put your make a pillow under your forehead. So now I want you to inhale and slowly lift one leg up, activate your feet, bring it down to the other side, squeeze your butt, pull your belly button in, keep breathing and get your core. So in this movement, we strengthen the back as well as strengthen your core here. So keep breathing, engage as much as possible and press your hips down to the mat. Make sure your, sh your shoulder all the way towards your hips. So your scapula, press it down. All right, and keep breathing. To your head lengthen, your neck lengthen here, and look down to the mat. And we do it five more times each side. To your left, to your right, to your left, and to your right. Couple more times with your own breath. Keep breathing. And three, two, 
last time lift and to the other side bring it down shake your hips from left to right very good now from here i want you to inhale and lengthen your arms over your head okay now this time inhale deeply and then try to bring your legs and your arms up now start to make a make a little pull here with your arms so as much as you can in 10 9 8 7 6 5 4 3 2 your legs and your arms down now this time cardio thing lengthen now inhale deeply and i want you to lengthen your neck here belly button in now lift both arms and legs up and bring it down speed it up as much as you can okay in 10 counts so when you're ready let's start 10 9 8 engage your core as much as possible 6 5 4 three two and one bring it down take a deep breath here inhale deeply and exhale deeply very good now from here i want you to inhale and slowly put your forearm in front of your chest here so your shoulder is on top of your elbows here press your forearms down tuck your feet into your core inhale and exhale deeply bring your hips up now this time lift your leg up bring it down to the other side Make sure you bring your hips down. Only your leg is moving up. Slowly engage your core as much as possible to the other side. And eight more times with your own breath. Keep breathing. Eight, seven more times each side. Very good. Six. To your left. Five. To your left. Four. Keep breathing. Lengthen your neck. Look to the middle. Of your hand here four to your left three try to leap as high as you can two and keep breathing use a breath to control the movement inhale up and exhale down bend your knees and bring your hips down take a deep breath here inhale deeply and exhale deeply all right now from here I want you to inhale and exhale deeply come back to the cardio thing forearms down just do it as the previous movement but do it as quick as you can in 10 count so when you're ready take your feet into your core inhale deeply and exhale lift all right now keep your hips and your knees together and start lift to the other side and quicker a little bit make sure your hips are balanced here and stabilized only your legs are moving up and down Keep breathing. Beautiful. And eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Make sure your shoulders are on top of your elbows. And two, last time. To the other side. Hips down. Come. Bring your hand be. Bring your hand, make, your, make a pillow under your forehead and take a deep breath here. Inhale deeply and exhale deeply and slowly allow yourself to come back to tripod position. Take a deep breath, inhale deeply through your nose and exhale deeply through your mouth. All right, very good. Now from here, I want you to slowly, when you're ready, try to lean on one side. All right. now. I want you to, from hips to head, just bring it to the back of the mat and bring both legs to the front. Now, shoulder on top of your elbows here, press your arms, your palms down to the mat. Pull your belly button in and shoulder, press it down towards your hips, so far away from your ears here. Now, inhale and bring your hand behind your head. Soft, soften your knees a little bit here. Inhale deeply, lift your hips up and exhale, bring it down a couple more times with your own breath slowly and bring it down inhale lift and exhale down and belly button in keep breathing here very good and we try to do it six more times with your own breath try to bring your hips as high as you can five 
lit and down four keep breathing three two and last time slowly bring it down very good now I want you to inhale deeply and exhale try to do it as quick as you can so inhale lift and down and lift and bring it down speed it up try to stick your heels together and your knees together here only your hips is moving up and down and belly button in lengthen your neck here so five four three two and last time slowly bring it down and move to the other side here very good all right now from here again I want you to, from hip to head bring it to the back of the mat and press your arms down your forearm down his shoulder on top of your elbows here bring your legs to the front and soften your knees a little bit here hand behind your head so inhale lift your hips as high as you can and exhale bring it down open your elbow to the back keep breathing inhale up and exhale down and couple more times with your own breath valley button in to support your lower back hips up a little bit more push and down and lift and bring it down five more times with your own breath four keep breathing three inhale exhale and last time bring it down shake your hips from left to right now from here try to do the cardio thing do it as quick as you can so inhale deeply lift and down and lift and bring it down now if you can if you have to adjust because you feel like your arms are too far from your body you always can bring your hand closer towards your body so bring your hips up and down and lift and quicker speed it up couple more time lengthen your neck here look toward the front and five four speed it up three very good engage your core as much as possible and last time bring it down now allow yourself to lie down on your back keep inhale deeply here and exhale deeply very good now from here bring your hands all the way up to the ceiling and bend your knees open your leg heavy apart now slowly inhale lift your shoulder up and exhale bring it down shoulder blade up and down stick to the mat shoulder awareness here inhale lift and exhale down couple more times with your own breath make sure you pull your belly button in and keep your hips balanced here inhale and exhale down and five four three two last time lift and bring it down now inhale draw your hips up tuck your tailbone forward and hand over your heart and bring it back couple more times with your own breath keep breathing make sure that your knees is on top of your heel so lift inhale over your heart exhale come back couple more times with your own breath belly button in squeeze your butt here very good and keep breathing beautiful and we do it 10 times with your own breath keep breathing nine squeeze your butt the key thing here is I want you to lift your hips as high as you can lift until you feel your butt here beautiful and couple more times with your own breath keep breathing use a breath to control the movement and we'll do it six more times make sure your hips are balanced and stabilized your arms feel the balance of your arms and your shoulder here too and three keep breathing two inhale up and exhale down inhale over your heart and exhale bring it down hips as high as you can and slowly bring it down arms down shake your hips from left to right now this time for the cardio thing arms along your body press it down and press your feet down i want you to stabilize your arms now because i um, want you to have more support for your whole body when you move up like that so inhale draw your hips all the way up and now I want you to make sure your knees on top of your heels here start to make a pulse with your hips here you can wider the range of the movement so lift it as high as you can and bring it down and pull your belly button in keep breathing here inhale and exhale now lift it 
and start to make it as quick as you can. Make sure you pull your belly button in, press your shoulder down and press your whole arms down here. Very good. And keep doing it with your own breath. Pull your belly button in. And five, four, three, two, and one. Slowly bring it down. Beautiful. Now keep your heels and your knees together. Inhale and lengthen one leg up. Lift and slowly bring it down. Make sure that you keep your hips balanced and stabilized here. Couple more times. Inhale, lift and exhale down. And lift and down. And three more times with your own breath. Make sure you press your shoulder down and your whole arms down to the mat. Belly button in, keep breathing. And two. And last time. Lift and slowly bring it down. Bend your knee to the other side. Inhale, lift and exhale down. Couple more times with your own breath. Inhale, up and down and up and bring it down. Make sure you use the breath to control the movement here so your hips are balanced and stabilized. And three, two, and last time. Inhale, lift and slowly bend your knees, bring it down, shake your hips from left to right. Very good. Now from here, I want you to inhale and then let's do the cardio thing. So lift your the other leg up here, inhale, lift, bend your knees 90 degrees and start to make a little pulse with your own breath. Keep breathing, engage your core as much as possible. And 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Slowly draw your hips down to the other side, activate your foot here. Inhale, lift and start to make a little pulse here with your own breath. Make sure that your hips are balanced here and keep breathing. And 5, 4, 3, 2, and one, slowly draw your hips down, hands down, shake your hips here. How you need your chest, take a deep breath, inhale deeply, and exhale deeply. And slowly lean on one side to the sitting position. Very good. And that's the workout for today, hope you guys enjoyed it. Please subscribe my channel to see new workout every single day. See you tomorrow, bye!